Hi there, meteorologist Leslie Lopez, and we have some cold air moving in. We have a little bit of snow falling right now into areas of Wrightwood, 23 degrees. It's a cool one. This is what the lens looks like over in a riverside. It's iced over uh, 36 degrees out there in a riverside. So we're waiting for a big blast of cold air to arrive here in Southern California. We're just a few short hours away. A lot of wraparound moisture coming from a low pressure center that's just to the east of us. And that wraparound moisture looks like uh, areas of Orange County, San Diego, the Inland Empire are getting most of that moisture right now, so it's really funneling in your direction. Eventually today, that cold air that's in Las Vegas right now, bringing in snowfall for them, will drop down into Southern California, and that's when we get to see our opportunity for some snow flurries, and that could happen anywhere in the Southland, except for the coastline, and that happens between noon today and about 5 p.m. So right now, again, a couple of those spotty showers still moving into areas of Orange County, waiting for more, and lots of watches and warnings. Another component with this, well, we could see some thunder, lightning, hail, that's all a possibility possibility today already seeing some lightning strikes near Yukaipa, the San Bernardino foothill communities and then here comes that snow and it looks like about noon to 5 p.m. already seeing snow along the grapevine El Cajon or I'm sorry the Cajon Pass also into areas of it looks like Lancaster Palmdale so the Antelope Valley high desert communities seeing that and then it becomes a little more widespread so we'll see if it happens in your backyard today but it would be interesting and a memory maker I'm sure temperatures today into the 50s we're seeing 53 degrees out there in Dana Point uh, mid 50s Pasadena also into Inglewood, 51 in Sino, and a high of only 56 degrees out in Malibu. For Los Angeles and Orange County, thunder, lightning, all a possibility with a little bit of hail. Temperatures continue to stay into the 60s and they get warmer. By the time we're heading into Wednesday, we're back up to about 68 degrees. Uh, it'll take time to get there, but uh, at least warmer temperatures are on the way. The valleys Inland Empire, 53. Overnight lows into the 30s, and if you are heading along over to the beaches, this is probably one of the few places we'll have to sit this one out, so I don't really think we're going to get any of that snow for the coastline, but cool weather and a little bit of rain. Mountains 24. We have 6,000 feet and above. This is great. 10 inches of new snowfall for our local mountain community. So this weekend it would be a great ski day. And if you're traveling out towards the high deserts, also looking good. 42 overnight lows into the 30s and the 20s. And eventually your afternoon highs will reach the 60s by next week. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.